fallout from retail thefts across the country. Dick's Sporting Goods is reporting a plunge in profits, blaming it on what they call organized retail crime. Chief Business Correspondent Rebecca Jarvis has the details. Good morning, Rebecca. Good morning to you, George. And more than a dozen major chain stores, including Target, Ulta, and now Dick's Sporting Goods, have called out organized theft as seriously impacting their business. But it's still hard to quantify just how serious it is with retailers having to self-report the problem. This morning, Dick Sporting Goods blaming an increasingly serious theft problem at its stores for a 23% drop in its profits. The retailer joining a growing list of companies, including Target, Home Depot, TJ Maxx, and Ulta, recently sounding the alarm on organized retail crime. It's extremely difficult to quantify the degree of the problem because not a lot of information is shared. From this flash mob stealing nearly $100,000 worth of items at a California mall earlier this month to big box retailers like Home Depot being hit especially hard and losing billions of dollars. According to the National Retail Federation, it's also becoming more costly, accounting for $94.5 billion in losses in 2021 alone with retailers reporting a 26.5% increase in organized retail crime. The vast majority said the violence and aggression associated with it increased in the past year. A lot of the stolen merchandise just ends up um, being resold on third-party marketplace online. Retailers say this type of crime is reaching unprecedented levels, forcing the average family to pay an estimated $500 more each year on goods. And the other impact here is clearly the safety and well-being of the in-store employees who are witnesses to these sometimes violent crimes. Retailers say the most common items stolen are removable, valuable, enjoyable, and disposable items, including things like clothes, beauty products, electronics, eyewear, office supplies, and toys. Guys? And of course, we end up getting paying for that mm -hmm. as the consumers. Yes. Rebecca, thank you. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.